G'day Michael, it's Jake here from Adelaide Vehicle Centre. Just want to do this video for you with the Ford Focus so you can see the condition on the outside and the features inside too. So we'll just start inside, I'll show you. Okay, so just starting with the transmission here, it's an automatic obviously, but there's also the sports mode down the bottom here, so you can there's plus and minus buttons on the gear stick there, so you can actually control which gear you're in and have a bit more um, control and power and things if you use the sports mode. So otherwise, you just drive it like an automatic. There's also reverse sensors on the car, so when you put it in reverse, it shows you on the dash, uh, the display up here, like how close you are, which is really handy if you're backing up against the wall or in a car park or something like that. It's going to beep and start to beep faster. It actually shows you how far away you are so that you're not going to damage the car. This Bluetooth here on up here on the steering wheel, Bluetooth control, so you can just answer calls here and hang up like that. You can also skip the tracks if you um, stream your music wirelessly and uh, control the volume here from the steering wheel. There's cruise control on the right, so that one you just activate it, shows up on the dash there. When you get to your speed, say 60 k's, you can just press set. It'll hold that speed for you, even coming up to a hill, it'll slowly you know, accelerate and uh, do what it takes to keep you at that speed. That way you can focus more on where you're actually going on the road, rather than uh, looking down all the time at the speedo, um, you know, worried about getting a fine or something like that. There's, the air conditioning is just over here, so nice and easy setup. That's the fan speed. That's the temperature here. It's nice cold air as well. And that's the mode, so if you like, just on the feet or hands and feet. That's the recycled air option. So if there's like a bus or a truck in front of you, you don't like the diesel sort of smell, I like to have it on the reverse. Yeah, the recycled air, sorry. Um, you can just listen to the radio, of course. In the glove box here, there's um, USB connection and auxiliary as well. So you can charge your phone or iPad or something or just listen to music on an iPod. Um, cup holders in the middle, really good for coffees. There's another charger here as well. If you've got a little adapter, you can charge your phone and iPad and things, and just uh, some storage in there as well. Airbags on the car for the driver's uh, steering wheel here, on the passenger side, on the dash, and also there's um, curtain airbags just behind my head there, which is really handy to have. The central locking too, so you can actually lock and unlock all the doors from the inside as well. But uh, just jump out, I'll show you underneath the bonnet. Inside the detailers clean the engine bay as well. Um, we, the first thing we do with the cars is send them off to mechanical inspection as well. So they top up the oils and oil filter, but also make sure the cars are 100% ready for sale. It's really important, Michael, that you check the bolt heads on the cars. So we always do this as well here on the guards. There's no tool marks on here and the edges aren't curved around. You can check on the bonnet as well. As you can see that they are then maybe they've taken this part away and it's probably for a crash repair or something. But from Adelaide Vehicle Centre, we have a full structural guarantee on the cars, so there haven't been any major accidents before. This car also qualifies for extended warranty. You get three months with us or 5,000 Ks, which covers some major mechanical components, but also has five years extended warranty, and that's unlimited Ks as well. So now we'll just walk around to the around the side of the car, get the looks in. Here's the nice rims on the passenger side. We'll just get a close up. Here's the minor sort of, really minor um, scratch I told you about on the rims. But looking down the side, there's a side intrusion bar. It goes through the doors here as well, which is a safety feature. So it helps to actually push the car away rather than just crumpling the doors if you're on the side impact of the car. Actually some window tint as well, which looks nice, keeps the car a bit cooler for you. And looking in the back here, there's actually airbags in the seats too, which is a good safety feature, but there's still plenty of space there and the, the trim looks in really nice condition. Just have a look here, um, the other scratches which I mentioned on the phone, still pretty minor. You can 
see the reverse sensors here on the back so the car's not going to be damaged and in the boot here there's plenty of boot space as well so three anchor points for child seats under here is the spare tire and jack and tools which are actually just under there you, you untwist this one and lift it up there under so um, you can if you're going to use more space you can fold the seats down as well so there's just a button there they fold down almost flat so you can do both sides if you need to move a table or something like that it's going to be lots more room okay so that's about it Michael we'll just get Sam to come around this way get a bit more condition of the car the paint looks really nice and I love the blue color too Thanks Michael, I'll send this to you shortly, we'll speak on the phone.